Cloma. First weekend in August, I headed to Cloma for a guy's weekend. It started out with me clearing a large tree near the property line. It turned into a tangled mess, taking out several other trees. I took down what I could after pulling the chain off multiple times and the fading light working against me.
The next weekend, we were back in Columbia camping with his friends. We headed to McCann Springs to get them acquainted with our Swift Key Waden. Anytime you can convince others to spend time on water is a time well spent. You see how tippy it feels? Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> You're good. You're stable. <laughs> you insist. <laughs> Dennis? Don't. <laughs> like a pro. Yeah. Back, yep. Right? But you have to watch out for stuff in front of you. So, like, if you see anything rocks or a uh, tree stump, you're gonna have to watch out for that and call that out. Like, okay, on my right hand side, there's a stick or a tree stump or something in the water. Propelling forward. Look at you. <laughs> if you don't mind my saying, you look a little uncomfortable. Relax. <laughs> <laughs> so he's very jiggly back there. And if I know. You need to be the jiggly one, you. It's, yeah, it's a little. I completely understand, and you can't see a damn thing he's doing, so you don't know what he's doing, and the boat is falling every time he moves. <laughs> yes. Far true. I absolutely understand. And I, I didn't, like, at first, I was like, ah, you're just overreacting, yes. blah, blah, blah. Yep. But I sat up in front and was like, oh, 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 oh. Yes. <laughs> I feel like I'm much higher. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Because the front of the boat is out of the water. I mean, it's not out of the water, but it is. Yep. 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 Who's Raba? We'll end up going to the right part of this little opening. To the left it will be to the McCann River, and to the right will be to the springs. And you don't want to take us on the river for our first time? <laughs> I think it's more beautiful to go to the springs. Very much more beautiful. Yeah. I'm like barely paddling. Oh, 
You're, you're propelling the. Yep. I was just paddling once in a while to see yeah, if I'm the worst judge of shifting. <laughs> so, yeah, it's like four foot down and we're like six inches in the water, but. <laughs> so, paddling here, you don't have much in the way of objects in the water. Okay. There are very few tree stumps, there are very few rocks, there are very few down logs, dinosaurs. Yep. <laughs> Something flying. Above the tree? Yeah. I, I, for all I know, it could have been geese. I have no idea. It looks like there's more than one. Yeah. It's like the land of the lost, just quiet and peaceful. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm loving it. Are you having any fun at all? I am. Okay, yes. Good. Yes. I totally am. I am. I'm not freaking out now. I'm trying to do the thing that you do on the motorcycle, where you just kind of let your hips. Yep, Pivot. that's exactly yeah. what you do. You just yeah. let it. You're a bobblehead, but you're a bobblehead from the waist up. Right. <laughs> oh, here it is. Oh, a yeah. striper. It's like I know it's like not like in a car, but. <laughs> It's also not bumper boats. <laughs> we play that. Yep. <laughs> I know you've played a tugboat before. Yep. So if you can go along the right shore. Okay, where the grass comes out here, yep. follow the grass around the corner. So my first time paddling was in 2017. Uh, my first time in a canoe was 2019. <laughs> so yeah. And I took her to a lake that <laughs> that was all full of tree stumps and shit. Yep. And then we started yep. seeing white caps as we were leaving. <laughs> yep. Cause he's nice like that. <laughs> yeah, learn sometime. We had we were running out of time to fucking yep. practice. Oh, right there. Yep. <laughs> so that's one of the springs coming out. If we look back up in that little weed, we can see like almost like a little waterfall. And that water is cold. Yeah, the water coming out of there. <laughs> But it feels so fucking good when it's like 80, 90 degrees out. Yeah, for about two minutes. Then you're frozen. Then you can't feel your feet. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Are we doing it? You're still upright in the water, of course. <laughs> Is that the sign you, you, you're getting the hang of? <laughs> you did not capsize yet. We need to back to the boat ramp, ramp yet. I'm not, saying, I'm not saying nothing. I said yet. Yeah. <laughs> and so the way that Chet and I paddle, he lets me paddle on whatever side I want and he will adjust accordingly. Well, that's kind of what I'm and doing. It, I'm just... Well, it's almost easier for that back person. I can't see shit. Yeah. Right, and to turn around it jiggles everything. Mm -hmm. and... mm -hmm. So yeah. Just... When I turn around everything jiggles. <laughs> I didn't hear you. I when said, he when turns turn around, around, everything, everything jiggles. jiggles. I know that. <laughs> Look at that beautiful sky. Mm -hmm. I think my mom called those like popcorn candy. Cotton candy? 
Well, no, she called Okay. There's a lot of times where she will be taking pictures or doing something, you know, getting more batteries out. And in the back, I, I can paddle on one side using that J stroke that I was telling you. And basically, you keep a loose grip with your, you know, the hand is by the paddle. And then you just turn your wrist and that causes it to kick out on the, on the top hand. And then I can steer the boat and just keep paddling on one side and keep it kind of straight. So you don't have to switch back and right. forth. I see. Another summer. Oh yeah, something is swimming right on Something's, the yep, summer's, yep, looks like a muskrat or something swimming across. I figured I was speeding up. It's like, oh fuck, she's getting close. There's bald eagle. bald eagle right above you. Yeah, another reason why I really like this place is there's very few people that come here. It, it, it seems like. Well, it's more, it's not really a boating kind of a boat. You know, it's so shallow, really. <laughs> Don't let him know. <laughs> the next thing is, should we turn back now while there's still light? Well, there's still down? some light, yeah, yeah, I think so. Mel, what do you guys think? I don't know. Fun, fun, fun. I'm not into those lakes where there's like a lot of people. Yep. Is the discount trickier than the mount? I think so. So in you would have to be you need to be mindful of your passenger behind you. Uh-huh. Otherwise you could dump him. Well that sounds more fun than me. It's not much of an exaggeration. And then what usually gets is I'll step out and then I think I got my foot out from the side of the boat. So the boat jumps up and then my foot is not clear. So then you kind of trip yourself? Yep, on the side of the boat. All right, somewhere off to your left should be the inlet. <laughs> On video. <laughs> well, we were doing good. <laughs> hey, you're still upright.
Why am I turning that the right way? Because you're back. paddling on the wrong side. Paddle back, paddle back, paddle back. I think you should jiggle on Melinda. <laughs> 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 